Back with the starters, we're up to question 59. This was probably the story of the offseason, and I think it says a lot about you as a person. <laughs> Me personally? <laughs> not you. Uh, looking right, at all right, of you. Right, not right. just looking at you. Uh, are you hashtag Team Westbrook or hashtag Team Durant? And I think this is perfect timing with all of these articles coming out on these two guys. Kevin Durant on the cover of Rolling Stone, Russell Westbrook on the cover of GQ. There was also a great Lee Jenkins article mm -hmm. on uh, for SI on Westbrook. You know, they broke up this summer. KD goes to the Warriors. <laughs> Russ, he re-signs and signs the extension with the uh, with the Thunder. What are you? What are you, Tass? Westbrook or Durant? Also great timing with Access Hollywood being in the news, because that's what it feels like to be on this it show. Right now. What, Billy oh, Bush? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hopefully we don't get fired like Billy. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> look, we never know the whole situation. Let, let's get that out there. But Russell Westbrook finds out over social media. Don't like that. Then, then Russell says to, to the media, listen, you can't just throw away seven years of friendship. We're going to talk at some point. That was back in August. They still haven't talked. Mm -hmm. To me, I'm Team Westbrook. I have to be. I have to be Team Westbrook because it just feels like he's been a little bit shorted in this situation. Yeah, I lean a little bit more towards Team Westbrook. I think if I was going to be on a magazine cover, I'd rather be on <laughs> GQ than Rolling Stone. And it seems like to me he really did nothing Bias. wrong in this whole thing besides just playing hard. And some of that comes off in him being a little bit hard-headed on the court, you know, doing things my way. And maybe Kevin Durant plays into that as well because he wouldn't necessarily work as hard off the ball. Some of that, I feel, though, comes from if he's standing on the side of the the other side of the court and Westbrook's handling it, he probably thinks, I'm never getting this ball back. So I think they're definitely both at fault. But Westbrook, a little bit less. I don't have a problem with what Durant did. He wanted to go and join the Warriors, so what? Who cares? He wants to go yeah. and play for a championship. He felt he was a better chance to win a championship with Golden State. Go there. Don't What's you think his obligation should, don't to you Westbrook? Think, just give him a call. Well, maybe give him send a him a text. They maybe haven't talked. This is like... What if he's on WhatsApp and he's, you know... Well, yeah. they, he's they, like, they, they literally text exchanged yeah, one text. Goes. That's fine. He told him that. In like five months, whatever it's been. Like, yeah, yeah, but how about, things how about move a on. Like, like, like <laughs> he, they, they've broken up, like you said. Kevin's now got to focus on his career in Golden yeah. State. They're, they're enemies on the court now. They'll be friends at some point later in life. While they're playing, while they're both uh, alpha dogs right now competing for a championship, they don't have to be friends. I, I wonder I if people's perception about this Team Westbrook or Team Durant changes, changes if Durant doesn't go to the Warriors, too. Like, let's say Durant might goes home yeah. to Washington and goes with the Wizards or goes to another team, and he doesn't go to a 73-win team that just sure. lost in the finals. <laughs> I it, don't think it, it does, probably doesn't change much to Russ, though, does it? I, the Russ well, specifically? Well, okay, maybe not to Russ specifically, but so, to so everyone, everyone else. else. Sure. Yeah. Because, yeah. Uh, look, a lot of people think it's ridiculous that KD, an For alpha sure. dog, one of the best players in this league, ends up just going to, again, one of the best teams already, yeah. if not of all time, in the Warriors. But which team, which fans' teams would have said, no, we wouldn't, we won't take him under those circumstances, or have that line? Of course, line Warriors fans yeah. are happy. Yeah. 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 But, no, but I'm saying, Durant. if well, any other team yeah. had that sort of makeup of players, they'd tell you, oh, we don't care, it gives us a better chance of winning the championship. So the other 29 teams are just jealous. That's all it is. It's not like, oh, they shouldn't have done that, that's not fair. Who cares? If Durant thinks he's, he wants to win a championship, he's been in the league nine years, yeah. you don't want to get to that situation where, like Kevin Garnett was in, in Minnesota, where it's like, I just want to now go and win. I've, I've done everything I can for this franchise. I'm going to be selfish and go and win the championship. And he got it. I think what's maybe sad about it is they were an unbelievable duo, Westbrook yeah. and Durant, and they could just never get over the championship hump. And yep. they, they ran into LeBron in the one finals, and then because of injury, let's yeah. be honest, a lot of times throughout those playoffs, could never get back there. You work with somebody for eight or nine years, I just want to call. I mean, what's the <laughs> great <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'll yeah, probably I'm call you. Okay, okay. Yeah, I'll call you, man. Probably. I mean, after, <laughs> after four months, like there's like, mm, let's say, a 90-day grace period. That's an awkward call to make, though. He's leaving well, him after so many years together, and he's going to play for their chief yeah. rival after losing them in the playoffs. What do you say? Be like, hey, man, I don't think yeah. you guys can do it, but I'm going to go over here and do it. That's a hard call to make. Yeah. 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 And and that's fine. I'm totally fine with all that. You know, you've got to be professionally selfish in KD's case. You're such a millennial. After, just texting all the after, time. Just call. He's done all he can for that franchise. It's like you know what? I'm going to go somewhere else. Good on you. Go for it. Did, uh, you, na did you say NAFTA? NAFTA? What? I thought you were talking about NAFTA there for a second. No. no. <laughs> but, but at the same time, having you've been watching that, too many debates, man. Yeah. Yeah. I just want to throw down. I would like, down. Down. I would like to see if Westbrook can carry the Thunder to the playoffs and to the finals. It's going to be fun to watch.